what's up guys welcome back once again it is me malt so happy to be here with you guys today ah oh, so stoked so we just had our second clan war as a clan divine nine guys we are now two out of three so we've won two uh lost one and the one that we lost was pretty gnarly because uh let's go look at this so let's go to our war log and let's go to the details of this thing and watch look, look at this so we're we're an all town hall nine clan right divine nine Let's go look at these guys. Let's see what their top base looks like, all right? Let's go see what their top base looks like. Are you kidding me? <laughs> How is even a Max Town Hall 9 supposed to get in there and crush it? Like, maybe. You gotta have a perfect attack. Let's go through some of these, though. So, this one was pretty hard for us, the one that we lost, um, just because, I mean, it's hard for... It, it was hard for Town Hall 9s to feel confident attacking... Um, bases like this so there were a lot of town hall <clears throat> there were a lot of town hall tens on that and then this last war guys that we just had it just ended uh we can go view the map on this one we won it but look at this look at all the town hall tens they have one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen fifteen blah 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 all the way down to twenty two and then some of these were town hall tens as well as you guys can see um the craziest one that is some that i think this is a glitch i need y'all's help defining what this is so look so here's the guy's base all right let's scout it here's his war base tell me how this happens all right so zoro all right zoro this is him right here this is his war base okay now watch this when we click here and we go to their clan and we go look at zoro did i pass it yeah and we go look at zoro look at his base I'm confused, guys. How is this the same Zoro? How is this the same Zoro? It doesn't make any sense. Uh, <laughs> I mean, are, are there two Zoros on their team? I, I don't know. I don't know if there are two Zoros on their team. <clears throat> but Zoro, right there, is you can see what his base looks like. And then we come over here. Let's see if there are two Zoros, because I could be completely off with this. Was that guy's name Derp? That's funny. Uh, yeah, there's two, there's only one Zoro in their clan. He's right here. And look at his base. That's, it doesn't even have everything that his war base has. How does that happen? You make a war base and then you just don't add anything to it? Is that how it works? I don't really know. But it, it looks weird. And during the whole, <clears throat> it, you, we can't see it anymore. I don't know why. But initially, when you would come in here and you would click on this, there would be, like, all of this area was filled in with these white things as if there were buildings there. And then there were little holes. So it was super weird. None of us knew what was going on. I don't have a picture of it. Um, somebody tweeted one. The door just closed because the air conditioning turned on. And that always freaks me out because I feel like there's somebody behind me. But there's not. So don't even say that there's somebody behind me because I know there's not. But we ended up winning this war, guys. <clears throat> I'll show you all my attack. It was epic. My attack was so freaking close. You guys are obviously going to see... That it was a three star. We're gonna go ahead and jump into this thing. Um, <clears throat> me against Thomas, feared hitman. And if y'all noticed, the clock started at two minutes and 51 seconds. So we had nine seconds left over, guys. We're gonna drop off our golems up here along with our wizards. We are gonna come in from the top of the base. The bottom of the base had that wizard tower sitting outside, it had some more upgraded walls, and it was a little bit further away from the town hall, so I just wanted to attack from the top. Okay, don't get mad at me about it, because I end up getting a three star. <laughs> but, as you can see, I have all loons in my clan castle, <clears throat> and I totally forgot to drop off my king at this point. I was like, crap, I have a king that I need to drop off, and he needs to get in the middle. So we drop him off, thankfully he does head straight into the center of the base, so thank you king, you're the man, I love you bro, I love you king. So he's heading in there, we got a lot of action going on in the center, town hall's already down, easy peasy. Uh, we got a couple wizards up, we got some pekkas up in there, both of our golems are still at like 75% health, absolutely crushing it. Our king is at like 98% health, he's taking no damage right now. Uh, there's a couple skeleton traps. We got a couple archers around the outside doing some work for us. As you can see, just taking out some extra percentages for us. I'm talking too fast and I'm out of breath. But that's okay because we're going to keep on going. You can see that we still have all three of our P.E.K.K.A.s alive. This one right here is taking a lot of focus fire right now. It is taking a lot. She is. I apologize, my dear, but you are taking a lot of damage. We got that archer tower on him as well as that cannon. Still have two other P.E.K.K.A.s alive. Um, where, two P.E.K.K.A.s? Two P.E.K.K.A.s. We have two total P.E.K.K.A.s alive. Both of our golems are still in their main form. They're in their biggest form. They haven't died. They haven't broken up or anything like that. We only have one P.E.K.K.A. now. And we've got all these archers down here at the bottom. 
Everything has been deployed. Uh, there goes one of our golems busting up and uh, destroying that building, actually. And then the other golem is about to go down. Let's see what kind of damage it does to these walls. A little bit. All right, so that one breaks up as well. Now, you can see that we've got uh, one little mini golem up there about to go down. He's going to die. Poor little guy. No, he died. But our king is doing fine. We haven't used his ability yet. We've got three archers, one P.E.K.K.A., and our king, and then one golem that is about to die now. So there that goes. So you can see how much we have left. We only have 88% left. There's three defenses still up, guys. There are three defenses up. We're going to use our king's ability right there. He's going to come in, take out that archer tower, and then take out this. And this is where it gets crazy. So the king is losing a lot of health as he tries to break through these walls. We're going to come in, take out this cannon right here. King goes down. We've got a couple barbarians, a couple archers. Look at this. We got some bombs. Everything is dead now except for the P.E.K.K.A. Come on, P.E.K.K.A., do it. Do what you're supposed to. Look at the P.E.K.K.A. P.E.K.K.A. goes boom with only a couple seconds left over and like 5% health and then one shots that elixir drill saying, I'm coming in, taking over your base. Mr. Thomas from Feared Hitman, you just got some fear put into you by me, Mr. Gaming with Molt, because I just came in and three-starred your base. Woo! So we three-starred him. Awesome job there. That was fun. That was an awesome war for us. We won. Uh, let's actually go and see some of their attacks on us. I haven't watched any of them, but I heard that some of them were hilarious. Uh, who was it that said they wanted it? Like, let's watch some of it. Let's see what happens here. 38%, okay? 38% against us. Let's see what happens. I don't even know who attacked. Can we fast forward? You can't. F oh, replay. Replay? Right? Yeah, okay. So they're coming in. Not a single max troop. What is this army composition? What are you doing? This is going to be bad. This is going to be really bad. There goes a golem and some wall breakers. Here go all the level 6 giants coming in. These loons are about to do work on these giants. Watch this. And on those wizards. Come on, take it out. Oh, it just took out a bunch of those wizards. The loons are still up doing some work. Uh, King and queen are down. This base actually, for some reason, unsymmetrical bases do really well sometimes. I don't know why, they just do. But I can't build unsymmetrical bases because it doesn't work in my mind. It doesn't work in my mind to do that kind of base build. But you can see that clearly it worked in this scenario. He still has a balloon up. There's still a balloon up. It's about to come over. And what is it doing? Where are you going, loon? There's nothing left. Owned. 20. I thought it said 38%. Oh, okay, so that's a 25% one. Anyways, absolutely owned. So finally, we won another war. We are two for three, guys. Uh, crushing it. We got a good amount of bonus loot. Y'all can see that I'm... I'm racking up that money. All I need is two million more uh, for when we hit our town hall in five days, 17 hours. So I'm probably gonna have to do like one more troll base and get rid of some gold, uh, especially if we win. If we win another war or the next couple wars that we win, I'm just gonna keep all my loot in there so that I can have extra storages because that's gonna be great for when we hit town hall nine. Boom, boom. We're gonna have extra. Uh, we're gonna have extra resources and everything. Let's let's check. Oh. I always click on walls. Do you guys always click on walls too? It's kind of annoying. So you can see that I can store 1,100,000 of each, 4,400 of the Dark Elixir. So that means that I can actually hold 7,101,000 uh, resources. So that's dope. That's going to be perfect for us. That is going to be great as we go up to Town Hall 9. We're going to be there very, very soon, guys. Very, very soon. But that is it. I want to, again, make sure that y'all answer my que answer my question <laughs> down below about how that guy's base is like that. Number two, how can he have everything on his main base and barely anything on his war base? Doesn't really make any sense to me. I don't know if it's a glitch or whatever it is, but you guys help me out there. If you guys did enjoy the video and you're loving everything, I'm posting two videos a day now for you guys, putting in a lot of work for y'all. If you are enjoying that, slap that like button for me, guys. I really, really appreciate it. If we can hit like seven likes, that'd be... Oh. Seven likes would be dope. <laughs> but that's going to be it, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you all enjoyed. You guys rock. You're so much cooler than me. You know that. And as always, make sure you keep calm and you clash on for me. All right? See you guys later. Peace.